We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. On today, Faithful Acolytes, we take a look at this. And what this is, is Tabasco Spicy Chocolate in this very nifty tin. And let's uh, see if we can get it open here. Ah, uh, you guys put the label. Okay, let's see where's the ingredients. Okay, we gotta let's get all this out of here, guys, so we can take a look at the ingredient panel. And we have Okay, sugar, chocolate liquor, bunch of chocolatey stuff, Tabasco, instant red flavoring, red pepper. So I think they probably used uh, dried like a powder I would assume here What are they calling this instant instant dry yeah instant dry let's uh see me figure out how to open it oh man I like this tin I do I, I think this is cool I just don't know if I can get my <laughs> I'm sure it'll open somehow, guys. Let's see. It doesn't screw, it just pops, but... Man, this is uh, a tough lid here. Okay, guys, I had some goop on my hands or something, but I couldn't really get a purchase on it. So let's just take a look here at what we have. We have... Oh my golly gosh, guys. I think it all melted together. So there's supposed to be eight pieces. Uh, it is summer as I film this, and I like this tin. I don't know. Can I get? I might have to get Mr. Knife to help us out some more. Let me do that. Okay. So apparently we. Uh, I don't know what shape these originally were in. Obviously they're all melted together now. Let's see here. It smells like chocolate. It doesn't smell like any Tabasco. So let's uh, let's let's just dive in. Definitely milk chocolate. Very sweet. It's a little, really little backburn. I'm not a fan of um, milk chocolate, especially. It's very dry and crumbly. But my favorite is more towards the dark chocolate. Um, it's not bad. There is a very, very moderate undercurrent of heat like a default one. Now, I'm not a big fan of Tabasco in general. Um, Tabasco sauce, in fact, delayed me really getting into the chili game because I disliked it so much. I've never been a fan of the flavor. And it's not hot, it's basically chili flavored vinegar, you know, Tabasco sauce, but you know, it's, it's October and we gotta have some candy here, right? Trick or treat is pretty unlikely, I think, this year. And it's nice to have some, um, you know, sweets, I guess, here and there. This is not a great chocolate. The, um, 
The Jaguar bar from hell was actually solid. It didn't have a lot of heat to it. This one doesn't either, but that was a lot better of a chocolate. And I'm not going to be able to even keep this tin because it's all melted in. But, I don't know, we'll finish the rest of this see if we get any heat out of it. I wish this was Mexican chocolate like the chocolate bar from Ella. If I do have to have milk chocolate, um, I like the Mexican milk, milk chocolate quite a bit. Some of the ones from overseas are okay too, from Europe and whatnot. I honestly intensely dislike almost every American milk chocolate that, that exists, simply because so many of them want to use the high fructose corn syrup, which is trash. This thankfully doesn't, but not an M&M. Definitely does not, um, definitely melts in your hand. Ah, messy, messy, messy. We'll do housekeeping later, guys. Um, so, having eaten the whole thing, sorry, now, having eaten the whole thing, as a chocolate, it's not great. And I don't know if the heat affected it or what happened there exactly, but it's a bit dry and crumbly. And that could have been due to the presence of the uh, the dried Tabasco that's in there. The dried Tabasco, I'm just getting just a little, very, very minor heat at the back of my throat. Just enough to let me know something was there. Uh, I did not get any Tabasco flavoring, which was good. So... I don't know. You know, if you have people like chocolate and they like spice, you could do worse than this. You could do better, like the chocolate bar from hell, but you could also do worse than this. So, I would say it's not bad. I will never get this again. It's a novelty thing. I honestly just got it just to do this video. Uh, I'm not a big fan of sweets in general. So, despite all the candy and junk that you see on the channel, I'm, I'm really not a fan of uh, that type of thing. You know, and, and I, I get into that a lot in the blog, which is in the link down below. So if you guys want to check out uh, a lot of my thoughts on some of that and what's going on with the video series and everything else, definitely encourage you guys to hop onto the blog and check that out. Uh, I get into that pretty in-depth if you're interested in reading more about it. But, yeah, anyway... Tabasco spicy chocolate tin. Default one again. I like the tin better than I like the chocolate. And I wish I could resurrect it. But it's all melted together and it's honestly probably not something I'm going to bother with. So, there you go. Now go forth in peace to serve the flame.